Okay, so I'd recently purchased a Stanley 201 mechanics tool set. The model number is right there. And I searched Google and YouTube and <clears throat> Stanley website, and for the life of me, I could not find a listing that showed exactly what was inside this tool set. So I decided to make a YouTube video and put it up there for anybody else who was actually going to buy this kit. Now, I bought it on Amazon. It was like $80, and with free super sh uh, shipper shaving, I uh, got it pretty cheap. So, I mean, the reviews are pretty good, four stars on it. And I haven't used it yet, but I'm pretty sure I'll be able to do a lot of things. So, now the easiest way to show you what's inside of it is just to show you the back. So, if it's... If you're at home, just pause the video when you see when you want to know what's inside. And so this is a mechanics tool set, and if you don't know what that means, it's pretty much sockets and and uh, ratchets, not really like screwdrivers or pliers or anything like that. That's in Spanish. I don't care about that. All right, I'm gonna open it up. So this case, everybody says it's a bad case. Now I can see why. I didn't mean it's plastic. A bunch of times opening it, it's probably going to break. It's sturdy from what it feels like. It opens up pretty well. And there goes some stuff right there. Okay. Let me put these back. One second. Being stubborn. And we're good to go. All right. It lights on. So it does come with three ratchets off top. It is a SAEN metric, so you do get the 916, half inch, all that, along with the uh, 10 millimeter through 19. I think to be exact, it's 6 through 19 on uh, sockets. You get everything from extensions, you get two of those. They're not very big, so what I when I purchased this, I did buy a Stanley extension set, and if you get it on Amazon, they're like seven dollars. So, and then I also bought a socket set that I actually didn't need because if I could find something that showed what was inside this tool set, I probably could have saved me some money. But since Stanley, the website itself, could not tell me what was inside of it, I spent money I didn't really have to. So you get eight uh, wrenches, and they're very big. Pretty much, with this tool set, you'll be able to take apart a lot of things inside of cars or around the house. Or I bought it mainly for car use. I have a little, little small tool set, and this thing's legit. Like, it's going to do everything I could think of. You do get big sockets. That's one thing I do like about it. 13, 14, 15, 16, and the 17. You get the big old 13, 16s right there. And some of them are somewhat of a deep well. Now the case itself. I heard some complaints about it being hard to take stuff out. And they are exactly correct. But, you know, in my opinion, I'd probably want that. Because you don't want to... You wouldn't be able to throw this in the back of the truck and just be able to... And have to dig around for tools. And, oh, where this tool's this way and this one's that way. It don't matter. For instance, taking this out. Yeah. They're going to come out like that. They kind of click in there. That's backwards. Yeah. It ain't going nowhere. You get the keys for the Allen wrench. There's two of them. Two sets. I like these since they have the push button release. Because a lot of times you... The screw or bolt you're trying to get to isn't exactly user friendly, and this thing makes life easier by making sure that your socket doesn't fall off. Now, the only thing about screwdrivers that you do get, and I think this is with any tool kit you ever buy, is you get this little guy. Oh, hold on. Let me turn that light off. 
is off my phone, so I apologize for the clarity. Anyways, and if you, those of you who don't know, you need that little guy right there. As always, they're always hard to get out. Let me connect this. And the tool set comes with flat heads and Allen sizes and pretty much anything. They got the little star sets back here. This is the piece that fell out when I was originally opening the box. So, I mean, technically it does come with a good screwdriver set. And the way it works is you just pull one out and you slide it in there. And that pretty much, and they're interchangeable, all these. I don't find myself using them too much, but it's better to have and not need than to need and not have. So, I mean, all in all, for 80 bucks, there's really not much you can do wrong, you know? If you're working on cars a lot, I would highly recommend this. The only thing that I could see you having to buy in the long run, maybe a toolbox? Most of the guys who buy stuff like this are probably going to have something like that. And uh, what I'm going to buy tomorrow are socket sets that are go all the way to 24 and wrenches that go all the way to 24 because, as you can see, they're big, but they're not big enough. I wanted to change some shocks out on a Chevy Avalanche, and I can't because I don't have a big enough socket to take a uh, lower attachment for the shock off. So... I mean, I got the, I can take care of the top screw or the top uh, nut, but not the bottom. Either way, I would highly recommend this for eighty dollars. Very uh, nice kit. Everything's nice and chrome. Everything came nice from Stanley. I would highly recommend from Amazon. If you have any problems with it, you can just return it. If you never bought from Amazon, it's it's freaking amazing. So yeah, if you guys have any questions, uh, I guess write me. I'll send you a review. Oh, I didn't tell you about that, but I think every every standard toolkit comes with this. It's a uh, spark plug uh, socket, 5 eighths. I think that's like the standard. Yep, 5 eighths. So all in all, like I said, buy extensions. Do it, because if you get this and try to... With these two little baby extensions, it's not going to work out for you. And uh, if you're doing big stuff, you're going to need uh, bigger sockets. I mean, these three ratchets are going to pretty much hold down everything you do. This thing I don't think I'll ever use. It's pretty big. You know, some, you know, maybe taking carts, car stuff off or, you know, lug nuts and such. So, yeah. Stanley tool set. Everybody says Craftsman's better. Well, probably is, but Craftsman has a warranty, and so do they. So when you have stuff like this, you know, I'm not really too worried about a ratchet breaking or a wrench breaking off because that's a warranty. Just get a new one. All right. If you enjoyed the video, hope it was useful to you. And one last time. In case it didn't show up the first time. See you.